the students are definitely different here. Um, yeah. We should stay as far away from it as possible, as far as I'm concerned. Do you like the students? <laughs> no, I would have to say no. I don't like them. Um, yes. No. Um, no. Do you like your job? No. 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 Do you think the students should be kept in restraints during class time? Hmm. Really depends on the extent of their criminality. Yes. Yeah. Most of them. They're really bad ones, especially. Yes. Would you say teenagers are innately evil? <laughs> yes. Yes, I would. Women are sometimes of the month innately evil. They can be, they can be, um, but I find most of them have a good side in there somewhere. What do you think of grade 10 students? Uh, some of them probably want to hurt us, I guess. They can be cute, but they bite really hard. I try not to feel about them. It hurts when they die. Would you find a whip useful while teaching? Yes, I think on occasion that would be uh, the most handy behavioral uh, modification technique I could ever use, so yes. Hmm, yes, that would be nice at times. Mm -hmm. Yes. Tranquilizer guns would also be good. Mm -hmm. um, how often do you uh, hit your students? Uh, I'd say at least a couple times a day, sometimes more. Depends kind of what my day's like. Not enough. Not enough. Uh, eight times a day. Uh, at least four times a day. Mm, probably every day. Once a day on average, maybe twice. I have sometimes use the fountain though, does that count? Sure. Oh, then more. Do you think the teachers are safe with the students? Uh, no, I don't think so. No. Yes, but are the students safe with the teachers? Do you think school should allow drugs? I don't like them. No. Yes, I do. Do you do drugs? With teenagers. What is your drug dealer nickname? Little Bear. Does the principal know about your uh, drug problem? I hope not. Do you know about uh, Little Bear's drug dealing? I'm sorry, Mr. McIsaac's drug dealing. Yes, I guess is the short answer. Some would be disgusted by Mr. McIsaac's drug dealing, but frankly, who can blame him? These kids live in a terrible world. I mean, they need a way to escape. That is Sardis Secondary School. It's a place where the teachers are crazy, the students are wild. Sadly, this reflects many of the school districts across the world. We need to do something to change that. Or do we? Should teachers be allowed to execute students? Judgment call. Oh yeah, some of them. When necessary, when it needs to be done. Do you wish you could get rid of all the students everywhere? Yes, I do, yes. Do you think there should be bars on classroom windows? Yes. <laughs> no. <laughs> How would I get out? There's a fire, I don't care about you guys. Yeah, I do, yes.
I hope this documentary has given you a lot to think about. I know it's given me a lot to think about. This is truly what the inside of a school is like. Some people have idealistic views of what a school is like, but this is a sad truth. This has been A School Without Borders.